Hello, everyone. Welcome to day two of the Donor Perfect Conference. Um, looking forward to a great session here with GiveCloud. And um, we're going to share a whole bunch with you about uh, the GiveCloud forms and the success rate that, uh, that they're able to have uh, in terms of uh, getting online donations. Um, we'll just take a little bit more time here as we take a look, see some more people that are piling in. Looks like we've got some pretty good attendance today. So my name is Daryl Moser, and I am the product manager in charge of partnerships. So this is uh, why I get to work with uh, great people like Keisha Simpson from, from GiveCloud. Uh, when we work with third-party companies that build integrations to DonorPerfect, so to share a little bit about uh, Keisha and her background from the nonprofit space, uh, in 2018, Keisha and her sister Tegan founded the Instagram movement Live Life Unfiltered, aiming to spread awareness on how social media affects young women's mental health. Later that fall, the sisters launched the As Shells campaign, uh, encouraging you know, young women to share their unfiltered stories on social media. The As Shells challenge reached well over 100 million people with participants from more than 60 countries, celebrities, uh, Olympians, activists, community leaders alike joined in. Alicia Cara, Catriona Gray, and Canada's First Lady, Sophie Gregory Trudeau, have all shown their support and acknowledged that being real and unfiltered is crucial to our mental well being. Keisha is also a recipient of Canada's Top 25 Women of Influence Award, awarded to Olympians and CEOs. In 2021, Keisha joined GiveCloud and brings a wealth of experience and passion for helping other nonprofits have a meaningful impact. So with that kind of a resume, um, I'm, I'm sure you all can appreciate that the, uh, the success that Keisha has had in the nonprofit space has been great. And I think she's joined a great organization to share uh, a little bit about the tools. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and turn it over to Keisha Simpson. Take it away. Thank you, Daryl, very much. Um, so yeah, as, as Daryl said, I am Keisha and I am a GiftCloud client account manager here. Um, so I collaborate with nonprofits using DonorPerfect to help them raise more funds for their mission. And I am very excited to be doing this presentation with everyone today. So in today's session, we're gonna be exploring a transformative approach that goes beyond traditional fundraising metrics that will help you engage and retain your donors. So we're gonna be covering uh, and discovering how to build meaningful relationships based on authenticity, trust, and human connection. To go along with our presentation, we're also gonna include a handout for you to download afterwards. So the presentation handout offers two key elements for an enhanced experience and lasting benefit. Firstly, we're gonna provide an in-depth summary of today's presentation. So you, no need to take notes, you can just sit back and relax and afterwards you'll receive a comprehensive summary capturing all of the key points. Additionally, we'll offer a bonus email template bundle with 15 plug and play templates. So these templates serve multiple purposes. For instance, they'll help you welcome new donors, announce fundraising campaigns, drive online sales, and convert one-time donors into monthly supporters. These templates are really valuable resources for crafting warm, engaging messages that foster connection, generate excitement, optimize sales communication, and build a sustainable donor base. With these 15 templates at your fingertips, you'll elevate your communication efforts and achieve your goals. And so without any further ado, let's dive in and I hope you enjoy the presentation. In the first part of this presentation, we're gonna talk you through the power of trust raising. So trust raising is a term that we coined here at GiftCloud to really help nonprofits move their fundraising beyond just the metrics and the data that tends to take a generous act like donating and turn it into a transaction. Tra transactions are quick, meaningless, and often forgetful. So as nonprofits, we really want to help your donors uh, to feel the complete opposite of this. We want them to, to be inspired when they make that donation. And this is really what trust raising is all about. Question before we begin. So 
I'm wondering if anyone's struggling to engage and retain their donors. It's possible that you're finding donors make a one-time donation, but then they never come back. Or maybe they join your monthly giving program and they leave after just a few months. So if you're struggling with this, my guess is that you're also wondering how you can turn this around and make your donors um, help your donors support your mission for the long term. So that's exactly the type of content and questions that we're going to be addressing in today's presentation. So if this is something you're struggling with, you will want to stick around. Breaking the noise. So how do we prioritize building and, maintain and maintaining meaningful relationships in such a distracted world? In today's information-driven world, it's so easy to get lost in the noise. Research shows that 74% of people like to compare charities side by side before they make a decision. But the thing is, prioritizing vanity and quick results over deep, meaningful relationships is not sustainable for long-term success. So it's time to flip the switch on traditional fundraising. Let's say goodbye to the still little tactics and hello to a new era of engaged donors and meaningful impact. Welcome to Trust Raising, the heart-centered approach that emphasizes truth, authenticity, and human connection. Trust raising helps us create genuine emotional connections with donors. It allows for more authentic communication and engagement with supporters. By building trust and foraging meaningful relationships, we tap into the very core of human interaction. In a world where things are often transactional, it's the emotional connection that truly drives us. By embracing trust raising, we unlock a world of benefits. We'll see increased donor loyalty and retention, enhanced donor satisfaction and engagement, and improved fundraising outcomes over the long term. To build authentic connections, first we need to identify and prioritize relationships with donors and supporters. So we must develop authentic communication strategies that focus on building trust. And most importantly, we need to align our work with the missions and values of our organizations to connect with supporters on a deeper level. Focusing on what matters to nonprofit donors is essential for building authentic relationships. Donors care about having an impact, feeling connected to the mission, and transparency. By prioritizing these values, we engage and retain donors and make a meaningful impact in the world. Now, let's shift our focus to donor-centered nonprofits. It's crucial to prioritize what truly matters to our donors in order to build authentic relationships that drive sustainable impact. To unlock the heart of our donors, we must understand what truly matters to them. Donors want to have a tangible impact and see the results of their contribution. They also crave a connection to our mission and a clear understanding of how their support is making a difference. In fact, and this is, uh, I found this very interesting, 45% of people state that they do not donate because they don't know how their donation is going to be used. Donors want to know that their contributions are making a real difference, which is why it's essential for us to focus on demonstrating impact and tangible results to engage and retain donors. Sharing stories and testimonials can help, help donors visualize the impact of their contributions and feel a deeper connection to the cause. Building a strong sense of connection between our donors and our mission is crucial. We want to foster a sense of community and shared values, allowing our donors to feel personally invested in our cause. And by providing opportunities for involvement and engagement, we deepen the connection our donors feel towards our mission. Transparency is also paramount in donor relations. Donors want to feel confident that their contributions are being used effectively and efficiently. 
by being transparent about our, how our funds are used and providing regular updates, we build trust and credibility with our donors. Transparency reinforces their belief in our organization's integrity. A really good example of an organization who's done an excellent job at trust raising would be True North Aid. So their entire donation experience is jam-packed with subtle details to foster the relationship between the donor and their mission. For example, as we talked about before, the number one reason why a donor chooses not to complete their donation is because they're unsure of how the nonprofit will use their hard-earned money. So you can see the True North Aid did a, um, combated this with the impact promise on their page to remind their donors exactly how their money will be used and the impact that it will have in the organization. To summarize, building meaningful connections with nonprofit donors is all about prioritizing impact, connection, and transparency. By focusing on what truly matters to our donors, we can foster authentic relationships, engage and retain donors, and make a lasting impact in the world. Now, let's explore the power of flexible donation strategies. These strategies are designed to engage donors and build sustainable support for our organizations. Donors have different financial situations and preferences when it comes to giving. So it's essential for us to understand and respect these differences by providing flexibility in the donation options. So it's just a sliding scale or reoccurring giving, we can meet the diverse needs of our donors. American Friends Amir Panam is a strong example of an organization who offers donors flexibility in their giving. So you can see that the donors can choose between one time or monthly giving, as well as they have the ability to increase or decrease their donation amount. They also utilize an upsell feature where donors can upgrade to become a reoccurring donor. And they, they did see quite a bit of success with this. So there's a whole case study that you can read on Mir Panam. Um, but when they added the upsell to their current donation process, they saw a 1300% increase in reoccurring giving. Which is not too bad. <laughs> As we saw, providing a variety of donation options increases engagement with our donors. When donors feel that their contributions are used effectively and efficiently, they are more likely to give and support our organization. So clear communication about how donations are used and the impact they make further strengthens their engagement. By offering diverse donation options, we can diversify our funding sources, making our organization more sustainable. Relying on a small group of donors for support is risky. When we provide easy to use donation options, such as a great mobile experience, we make it convenient for donors to contribute and support our cause. Donation options play a crucial role in building trust with our donors. By demonstrating transparency and a commitment to their needs, we show our donors that we value their contribution. Donors want to feel that their donations are making a real impact and that their support is valued by the organization. By offering a range of donation options, we show that we value the contribution of all donors, regardless of the size of their gift. This inclusivity and appreciation help to build lasting trust with our donors. Flexible donation strategies offer numerous benefits for nonprofits. They empower donors by providing them with choices, choices and options that suit their preferences. This in turn leads to increased engagement, sustainability and trust. By focusing on meeting the needs and preferences of our donors, we can build long-term relationships and make a significant impact in the world. 
Now we're going to dive in to the significance of demonstrating impact and how it can inspire action, attract new donors, and ultimately help us achieve our mission. So let's dive in. We know your goal is to have a positive impact on the world through your cause. So sharing the impact you're already having can and does inspire donors to take even more action. I'm wondering if you've ever wondered how to showcase to our generous donors that their support is truly making a meaningful difference. So in this next section, we'll look at various tactics and examples of nonprofits that have done a great job at inspiring action, attracting new donors, and ultimately helping us achieve our mission. So let's dive in and see how to make a lasting impression. Building trust is crucial for any nonprofit organization. Sharing the impact we are making allows us to establish trust and credibility with our donors and supporters. They want to see tangible evidence that their contributions are truly making a difference. By sharing impact, we can demonstrate our accountability and transparency as an organization. Donor engagement is essential for the success of any nonprofit. Sharing impact not only increases engagement, but it also garners more support from our donors and supporters. People want to be part of something meaningful and impactful. When they witness the tangible results of their contribution, their commitment and involvement with our organization soar. Effectiveness is a key factor for donors and supporters when choosing which organization to invest in. Sharing the impact we can, we've achieved allows us to demonstrate the effectiveness of our programs and activities. By providing compelling data and impactful stories, we can share that our organization is truly making a difference in the world. And this becomes particularly important when attracting new donors and supporters who are seeking organizations that are not only effective, but also impactful. This one may be a bit of a surprise, but 36% of donors stated that they received zero communication after their first donation to an organization. This is exactly the type of um, the type of thing that we're looking to not happen because it makes the donor feel like they're a transaction. I don't think I've ever seen an organization do a better job at communicating impact than help Santa toy parade. So they really knocked it out of the part, uh, park. So they, they chose a donation experience that engaged their donors and showed their impact in real time. So the donors were able to pick between whether they wanted to donate toys, toys for an entire Christmas for one child, or enough toys for an entire family's Christmas. And the results of this campaign spoke for themselves. So when they moved from a regular PayPal form to this gift cloud experience, they ended up raising 200% more than their initial goal. In the next part of this presentation, we're gonna explore the power of connection and why it's crucial for nonprofits to show donors how they contribute to impact. Donors are the backbone of our organization and their support is instrumental in driving our mission forward. So let's dive into the significance of fostering a strong connection and understanding how we can demonstrate to donors their vital role in making a difference. When it comes to building a stronger connection with our donors, it's essential to show them how they contribute to the impact we make. By demonstrating how their contribution makes a tangible difference, we can foster a deeper sense of connection to our organization and its mission. Donors want to feel like they're part of something meaningful and impactful. They want to see firsthand the positive change that their, supporters, that their support enables. And by showcasing the impact of their contribution, whether this is through photos, videos, or personal stories, we can help donors feel more connected to their cause. One effective way to strengthen our relationships with donors is by showing them how their contribution made a significant difference. 
This not only demonstrates our gratitude and appreciation, but it also helps donors feel valued and recognized for their support. By showcasing the specific impact of their gifts, we can emphasize the importance of their generosity. It's important to go beyond just the general statements and provide concrete examples of how their support has transformed lives and communities. To effectively show donors how they can contribute to impact, we need to utilize various communication channels. So nonprofits have a range of options at their disposal, including newsletters, annual reports, and impact reports. These resources provide an opportunity to share compelling impact stories and data with our donors. By presenting the progress and achievements made possible by their support, we can reinforce their connection to our organization. Additionally, social media platforms and email campaigns can play a significant role in showcasing impact in real time. Through these channels, we can engage donors and provide timely updates to our work. Impact stories have the power to touch the hearts of our donors and inspire their ongoing support. As nonprofits, we have the opportunity to collect impactful stories from program participants, staff members, and other stakeholders. These stories can then be shared with our donors through newsletters, social media, and other communications channels. By presenting these stories, we allow our donors to emotionally connect with our organization's mission and the individuals we serve. Personal narratives highlight the difference we're making in the lives of others, making the cause more relatable and inspiring continued support and engagement. In this final section of our presentation, I'm gonna talk to you about the power of fun in the nonprofit sector and why it's important for organizations to make the donor experience enjoyable. So let's hop in. The donor experience is essential to building engagement and support. So it's not just about receiving donations to your charity. It's also about creating a connection with our donors. By making the donor experience fun and enjoyable, we can increase engagement, retention, and satisfaction. Online fundraising offers tremendous opportunities to make the donor experience fun and engaging. So we can leverage the power of gamification to create interactive and entertaining fundraising campaigns. And by doing so, we can increase participation and support from our donors. When we make the donor experience fun and enjoyable, we go beyond just having this be a mere transaction. So we don't, donors want to feel connected to our cause and to our organization's community. So by infusing fun right into the experience, we can build a stronger sense of connection and engagement with our donors. Social proof is a powerful tool that can make the donor experience more enjoyable and motivating. So by highlighting the impact of donor contributions and showcasing the support of others, we can create a sense of FOMO or fear of missing out. So this can inspire donors to give more and get more involved, creating a positive cycle of engagement and support. Clearly, Wildland Firefighting Firefighter Foundation understood the assignment. So rather than having a long, boring form field with 20 different fields to fill out um, that kind of made you feel like you're doing your taxes, they went with an experience that is actually fun. So you can see they've gamified different elements of the forms by using clicks to discover and adding functionality like status badges and social proof pop-ups. And the social proof pop-ups, what they're really doing here is they're piggybacking on the donor's natural desire to be part of a group or a community. Additionally, with modern payment options, this automated and the automated upsell to become a monthly donor, they made giving easy and convenient. For the donors that were wowed by the mission and the donor experience, what you can't see on this um, on our slide, but on the next page of the donation experience is that they could easily share the experience and the mission to their social media channels with just a click of a button.
As nonprofits, we have various opportunities to make the donor experience fun and enjoyable. So we can design fundraising campaigns that are interactive, entertaining, and rewarding. Additionally, personalized thank you messages, donor recognition, and special events can all contribute to making our donors feel valued and appreciated. Making the donor experience fun and enjoyable is crucial for building connection, retention, and satisfaction. By incorporating strategies such as fundraising, gamification, and social proof, we can create a dynamic and engaging donor experience. Moreover, by making our donors feel valued and appreciated, we foster a stronger sense of community and commitment to our nonprofit missions. Let's shift our focus to the um, effectiveness of donation forms and how modernizing them can significantly impact our fundraising efforts. When it comes to a donation form, simplicity is key. So by simplifying the form fields required to complete a donation, we can achieve higher conversion rates due to the ease of use. Additionally, a simplified form enhances overall donor satisfaction. So remember, less is more. Just to give you an idea of how having a complicated form or a checkout process really does impact conversion, 18% of people abandon their cart because of a long and complicated process, which includes having too many form fields. So here you can see a difference between a traditional donation form and a simplified modern one. On this slide, we have the image that compares the two side by side. The modern one, the modern form is clean, concise, and user friend friendly, showcasing the positive impact of a simplified approach. Breaking up the donation form into smaller sections through a multi-step format can significantly improve the donor experience and increase your conversion rates. By doing so, we provide a sense of progress and accomplishment, making donors more likely to complete the donation process. Now, let's discuss the importance of offering multiple payment options to our donors. So providing a range of payment methods like credit cards, PayPal, and Apple Pay, we enhance the donor experience. Donors appreciate the flexibility and convenience of different payment options, which can ultimately lead to increased engagement and support. One way to elevate the donor experience is by allowing donors to choose how their donation is used. So by including options to support specific programs or campaigns, or to choose a specific donation amount, we provide more control over their contribution. This customization not only increases donor satisfaction, but it also fosters greater engagement. Modernizing donation forms can significantly boost efficiency and improve the donor experience. By reducing form size, implementing a multi-step format, offering expanded payment options, and providing customization options, we increase conversion rates, donor satisfaction, and engagement. Investing in modern donation forms is a strategic move that streamlines our fundraising efforts and ultimately increases our impact. The last example that I, I have to show you today is Oh Miami. So they implemented Gift Cloud, um, including all of the best practices that we've talked about on today's call. The neat thing is they actually went live with Gift Cloud in under 24 hours. Um, so by the time they created an account and they were live accepting donations, it was less than 24 hours, which I believe just goes to show how easy to use Gift Cloud is, but also why it's so important to find a solution that is jam packed with industry best practices, because then you don't have to spend days or even weeks um, trying to make the trying to make the solution work for you the way you need it to. Thank you for staying with me. So that is the end of this presentation, but I just want to take a few moments here to introduce you to Gift Cloud. 
So gift cloud is the future of fundraising that guarantees, and when I say guarantee, I mean we literally guarantee more donations and a better donation experience. With over 2,000 organizations already utilizing gift cloud, it's a proven tool that increases conversions and donor loyalty. But the, the best part is we were actually built specifically for Donor Perfect. So Gift Cloud was founded as an add-on to Donor Perfect over 10 years ago. And because we were built for them, Donor Perfect is just in our, it's in our, the DNA of the company. Uh, so being built for Donor Perfect means that you won't find another solution that integrates with them like we do. It's a native integration, it's in real time, and it's very customizable. Additionally, Gift Cloud boasts top-notch customer support with our 97% satisfaction rate, ensuring fast and effective assistance wherever you need it. So you can trust in Gift Cloud to be reliable, lightning fast, and we have great robust security. Additionally, the, the best and most exciting part is that Gift Cloud actually has a $0 monthly fee zero dollar platform fee and zero contract plan, ensuring that you can use gift cloud risk free. Thank you for your attention. And remember that when it comes to fundraising and donor experience, gift cloud is the solution that will take your organization to new heights. Daryl, I will pass it off to you now for Q and A. Oh, actually. <laughs> Don't forget, um, good thing we had the slide here because I almost forgot, uh, but don't forget that you you can grab our, um, you can grab the copy of our presentation handout, which has a comprehensive summary of everything that we've covered today, as well as the email template bundles that we started talking about at the, at the beginning of this presentation. And now we can pass it off to Daryl for Q&A. Where is Daryl? Daryl, are you here? It looks like um, Daryl's not here, unless I'm misunderstanding something, but we are still live. <laughs> um, so let's see if we have any questions that are coming in. Yes, I will go through the Q&A one second here. So we've got one organization that is asking what you what I meant with the guarantee. So Gift Cloud has a guarantee um, that you'll never be out of pocket for our solution. And so what that means is that actually the average donor perfect organization, when they add on Gift Cloud, to the current donor perfect solution, we'll see that their online fundraising will increase by 72%, which is why we're so confident um, that you will see your fundraising increase with gift cloud, which is why we can offer the guarantee that we do. Uh, so essentially, um, if, if you don't see your fundraising increase, we will uh, give you a hassle-free credit that will be applied to your account. Let's go through the next question. Um, so someone's trying to understand how to use the donation form experience. So if you want to use the donation form experience that was included in this presentation today, you can just hop over uh, to giftcloud.com and you can start an account right now. Um, and I'm sure maybe one of my colleagues could throw the link to Gift Cloud right in the, the chat um, the, the chat 
channel and that's where you can create an account. Literally, you can go live in a couple minutes and setting up the integration with uh, Donor Perfect is really easy. So again, we've had organizations go live with Gift Cloud and Donor Perfect in less than 24 hours. Uh, and I see another individual asking about, um, so if you're worried about the integration, it's it's pretty awesome. <laughs> it's what we do best. Uh, so it's real time native and it's highly customizable. So you'll be able to set up the solicitation code, the sub solicitation code, the general ledger code, et cetera, as well as your own custom custom fields or your own custom user defined fields. This is a great question. How do you engage a community whose donors are much older? possibly in their 70s and 80s, who are not necessarily comfortable using computers. How we address that, so, so Gift Cloud has invested heavily into our donation experience. It is our bread and butter, and we've spent a lot of our resources testing it um, to make sure that it's optimized for every generation, including those that are 70 and 80. At the end of the day, we need your donation experience online to be really user friendly or else we are going to lose those 70 and 80 year olds. Um, so that's why Gift Cloud is so clean and simple, the experience, so that you can see your conversion rates. Um, you can maximize each donation experience to the highest potential. Uh, so what you'll notice on some of the campaigns we went through today is that everything was multi-stepped. So not your, your complete donation experience wasn't on one page, which has been done on purpose specifically for the older generations to make it just easier to fill out um, and really kind of celebrate each step in the progress. So for example, once they paid, you can have some confetti come down and, and really celebrate that the donation has come, gone through. And then after you accept their money, that's when the upsell occurs, asking them to become a reoccurring donor. Um, do you think it's more important Important to uh, so this is from Gabby Lloyd. Do you think it's more important to communicate impact frequently or less frequently with annual fund donors? Should I share impact stories more often with monthly donors? Yeah, Gabby, what we would recommend uh, from the results that we've seen across the organizations we work with is definitely to to share impact as often as you can. Um, because the, the reality is donors aren't going to see every uh, email that you send out um, or every text or newsletter. They're not, they're not gonna read all of it because it's busy. So you really want to make sure that they, that they are staying connected with your mission and, and those impact stories are really what help them feel that, feel that connection. Um, this is a great, a great question from Nicole Moser. So how can you communicate with donors who aren't interested in the emotional impact and are more interested in where their money is going? So a hundred dollars went to this person, $500 to this country, et cetera. Great question. Um, so that's where, as we saw on one of the examples I showed, there was an impact uh, promise. So with True North Aid, they had this. And you can create just a general statement on the impact promise, like your, your donation is going towards helping our mission um, so, so, for example, for the charity I support, it would be your, your donation is helping spread the spread awareness about how social media is affecting young people's mental health. Or you could get much more specific. You could say, so they gave $100. You could say $80 is going towards funding the um, funding the awareness campaign on how social media is affecting young women's health and $20 is going towards paying admin fees. So you can, you can get right into the specifics and break it down for them. Uh, 
Sorry, I'm just reading through these. So from Janet Carroll, Keisha, with dedicated funds when donors are given a choice, what they support takes away from a min or operation funds. I'm not quite sure what we're asking here, and my apologies, Janet, um, but feel free to email me at Keisha at givecloud.com for clarification. Although what you might be asking is whether we have donor cover cost, which we do. Um, and our donor cover cost actually has AI plus technology, meaning that it's, it's a new way of collecting DCC and it's far more effective. But then to, to answer your question, Janet, DCC can be pushed into donor perfect as one gift or it can be logged separately. Um, I'm not sure if that's what you're asking, but uh, if it's not, feel free to email me. <laughs> Is Gift Cloud available for Canadian clients? Yes, 100%. And uh, we can 100% handle all of your Canadian tax receipts. I am actually in, I'm in, located in Canada. Canada, Ottawa. How do you compare with Raisin? Um, so, I mean, I think we're pretty awesome, but Raisin's a good solution too. <laughs> uh, but it, it, it hard, it's hard for me to know exactly what you're looking for there from this anonymous user in comparison to Raisin. What I will say is that uh, Gift Cloud specialty is the donation experience. And so again, that's our bread and butter. So if you're looking for, if you're looking to improve your online donor experience and make sure that you're optimizing every donation to its highest, um, to, to the highest potential, that's where you would look to add Gift Cloud. And then because we were built for Donor Perfect, we were founded as an add-on specifically for Donor Perfect organizations. Um, the integration with Donor Perfect is, is seamless. Uh, so it's native, real time, and highly customizable. What is the additional, so anonymous user has asked us what the additional cost to having gift cloud with donor perfect is. Great question. Um, so as I said at the end of this presentation, gift cloud has a plan, our express plan that has zero monthly, um, a zero monthly subscription, zero platform fees and zero contracts. So you can get started with gift cloud at a, uh, with, with zero monthly contracts, zero, uh, zero subscription fee, and uh, zero platform fees. Um, that would give you access to our donation experience. And so I, I would recommend everyone to check that out. Then if you're looking to use some of the other functionalities that Gift Cloud has to offer, there are other paid plans available. So for example, if you wanted to use Gift Cloud for your online store, or if you wanted to take advantage of Gift Cloud's events and fundraising solution, or our children sponsorship solution, um, those would be all functionalities that you could upgrade to some of our paid plans for. And you can see all the pricing available on giftcloud. Uh, on giftcloud.com. Um. So, sorry, I'm I'm reading these as I go. So Denise is asking if we can use Gift Cloud for event registrations. And the answer to this is 100%. So Gift Cloud has an event solution as well as, um, so this includes the ability to sell tickets. Uh, and in the experience of selling tickets, you can have unlimited custom fields. Some can be required, some can be non-required. You can also ask in the same experience if they want to make a donation or if they want to buy a t-shirt. So all in one checkout experience, your donor has registered for an event and they've specifically filled out the custom fields that you've asked as well as the different 
uh, ticket options, whether that's like child versus adult, et cetera. And then they can also make their donation and they can pick out their t-shirt check out once they'll receive a thank you email and a tax receipt which can include fair market value if you use that and a qr code which is great for fast check-in at the event so come time of your event you can just use a regular iphone and your uh, attendees can pull out their qr code which you can scan to let them in it'll bring you to a nice fancy report uh, right in gift cloud and you can just check a mark that Keisha Simpson has attended and for anyone who's working with a lot of older donors if they don't know how to use QR codes or they forgot their QR code it's, it's not a worry at all that you can just manually check them in great question Denise Not quite sure what this question is asking, um, but I believe uh, we have an anonymous user asking if a donor can designate their fund on a donation page, and the answer to that is yes. So we didn't see it in today's presentation, but we also have an experience where they can choose where their donation experience goes to, and they can give to multiple funds all in one checkout process. So they could give $25 to, so if we look at my charity for as an example, they could give $25 to the As She Is campaign, $50 to the Keep the Lights campaign, and then $100 to the Building Fund campaign, check out all at once and receive a tax receipt. And each of those different campaigns because everyone here is using Donor Perfect, can have different general ledger codes or sub solicitation codes, et cetera, to help for easy accounting. So another organize, uh, I've got another question asking about fees. Um, so yes, to reiterate, Gift Cloud has a zero dollar monthly plan and um, zero contracts. So I have anonymous user asking about the benefits of Gift Cloud's donation forms. Um, as I shared before, the average organization that comes from Donor Perfect will see a 72% increase in online fundraising. Um, the benefits of using Gift Cloud is that we have a lot of functionalities designed to help you optimize every donation experience to its fullest potential. Uh, so. The donation experience is what we do best. It is our bread and butter, and we've put a lot of resources into making this experience um, just best in class. And so what you'll see is that there's different functionalities that you'll have with Gift Cloud um, that you may not have had before, including the ability to upsell your one-time donors to become a reoccurring donor. That upsell feature actually works five to 10% of the time. Uh, and as we saw in the presentation with Mir Panam, they, when they added the upsell feature, so they moved from uh, a WordPress uh, solution to Gift Cloud solution, they saw a 1300% increase in reoccurring donors, um, which is largely credited to the upsell functionality that Gift Cloud has. Um, and again, there's a case study on our, on our site if you wanted to check that out. Some other additional functionalities that GiveCloud has that are really great to improve your online um, experience and really your um, your average donation amount is our donor cover cost AI plus functionality. So most of us, I'm guessing, are familiar with donor cover cost. It's the where we add ask donors to cover uh, percentage. Um, an additional percentage to help pay for the fees. Typically, we ask donors to cover three or 4%. And this is a very standard feature that is works across all the different platforms, um, across most platforms. But GiftCloud has found a new way to do donor cover costs that is really effective and frankly exciting. So what you can do is you can add, um, you can use a new functionality called donor cover cost AI plus and, uh, Spoiler alert, <laughs> the average organization, when they switch from the 
old way of doing DCC to the new donor cover cost AI plus functionality is that they'll see um, they saw DCC increase by seven times. And so we have a white paper on this available on our website as well if you want to check it out. But essentially, Gift Cloud last summer started experimenting with new ways of doing donor cover cost. And when we added AI plus technology uh, and we released it to 150 organizations, those 150 organizations saw their donor cover donor cover cost revenue increase by seven times. So a good example would be, let's say your organization raises $10,000 a year in donor cover cost. If you switch from the kind of the old way to doing it to Gift Cloud's new innovative way, you should see that $10,000 increase to $70,000. Again, we have a white paper on that if you want to check it out in more detail. Yep, so we have a few more questions about Gift Cloud's donation experience and some of the improvements. Um, again, uh, the experience is embeddable, which is great. And you can go live in, uh, with the Gift Cloud form in a few minutes. It also has a bunch of gamification um, included into it, which is a great way to increase your donor engagement. So an example of some of the gamification in Gift Cloud's experiences would be our um, social proof pop-ups. So we saw that in the presentation today where those, those uh, little names would pop up onto the donation form and then they would disappear. So it might say like Keisha or KS from Ottawa donated a hundred dollars. What were, oh, Daryl, <laughs> you're back. <laughs> hey, uh, you were doing great, though. Keep going. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, and so one of the advantages of the social proof, uh, social proof pop-ups is the ability to, um, we're, we're leveraging on the donor's natural desire to be part of a group. So donors, just like regular consumers, are impacted when, um, Donors, just like regular consumers, are impacted when they know that other people are buying the same product. In this case, your charity is not a product, um, but they're also impacted when they see that other other members of their community are, are making a donation to the same charity. Another uh, great functionality that you'll see with Gift Cloud is the status badges. So as if we, when we saw some of the different donation experiences with Gift Cloud, you could increase your donation amount or decrease. And I'm not sure if anyone noticed this because it was very subtle, but when you increased your donation amount, so if you went from $100 to $150, you actually could get emojis that would pop up, so hearts, kind of motivating your donors to give a bit more. And you can also get status badges that it can appear. So the status badges appear as the donor continues to uh, to donate more to your um, donate a higher amount to your charity, which is a really good way to just increase them to uh, to encourage them to increase their online donation. Um, I was just going to say, we can definitely stay on for a few minutes. It looks like the Q&A has gotten packed full of really great questions here. So um, it has. if for any reason we can't answer all of them, um, we can also um, pull them down and reach out to you individually. Uh, we can have Keisha and GiveCloud reach out to you as, uh, as a means of answering the questions. Um, I do see that there's a current client from Dawson College. I don't know if you had uh, caught that one yet. Uh, they were just wondering if there's any new integrations coming from GiveCloud. Tons. Um, and so we just released MailChimp, I think last week. Don't quote me on the exact date. Uh, we're releasing another one with active campaigns. Um, we have a full integration team uh, working uh, hard on our integrations. So they are, they're coming quickly. I'm tech, I actually have a hard time staying up to date on our integrations. <laughs> <laughs> they're just indeed. always appearing so. <laughs> indeed and and just a reminder if anybody wants to get a follow-up from Keisha and or the give cloud team go ahead and uh, go into the poll and um, just say yes to learning more and we'll make sure that we reach back out to you um, looks like we've got five minutes before the next session starts but uh, let me just go ahead and grab another question here 
I'm not sure if you might touch on this one, the donor portal, can it be used with a special subset group of people that aren't donors, but recipients of a certain fund? Um, so I'm not sh sure exactly what we're asking, but the donor portal, so GiftCloud has a donor portal. For anyone who doesn't know, the donor portal gives your donors the ability to log in and manage all of their own information. So they can download a tax receipt or update their payment method. And the, the key here, the really important fact is that because GiftCloud was built for Donor Perfect and we were founded as an add-on, the integrations in real time. So if your donor updates their donation from $100 a month to 150 or they change their billing address, that will all push over into Donor Perfect in real time. Um, so the two systems are always in sync. And you can get an update to let you know that like, hey, Keisha logged into her donor portal and she changed her billing address or her payment information, et cetera. Um, to answer the question, though, I didn't answer the question. Uh, <laughs> to answer your question, Gift Cloud, uh, you can have different groups of donors when they log into the portal, see different types of content. So for example, if you're running a membership program through Gift Cloud, because we also have a membership functionality, when your donor logs in, uh, the gold members can see a different donor portal than your non members, um, which allows you to customize the storytelling experience for different types of uh, donors. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Um, well, with that, uh, we're just a few minutes away from the 1230 session starting. I want to give everybody yeah. an opportunity to move on to what our 1230 sessions will be. Uh, some really great topics are out there. Keisha, thank you so much. You have been a wealth of knowledge, and I am super excited about the GiveCloud product. I think the new form experience, I know there's a question that's out there about the difference between the GiveCloud form experience and the new ones that Donor Perfect have created. And just what we've seen is, is the gamification, the added features that you get with GiveCloud. Uh, just take it to a much higher level. And, um, you know, I like to say in the partnership programs, we sort of have a good, better, best mentality here. And GiveCloud is one of the best from the forms perspective uh, at this time. So um, with that, I think we'll, uh, we'll wrap this up. And uh, any of the questions that didn't get answered, we, uh, we will try to get back to you, uh, perhaps via email. And uh, enjoy the rest of the conference, everyone. Thank you for attending. And I can, yeah, just leave off if you want to start a GiveCloud account you can uh, go live in a few minutes just by creating an account on GiveCloud.com. Awesome. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks Daryl.